Boyard, an ancient island fortress surrounded by the Atlantic Ocean, home to a vast hoard of tantalizing treasure and inhabited by a host of grisly guardians. Undaunted, six intrepid teams of young adventurers have set their eyes firmly on the fort's prize. Their mission to beat any challenge the fort throws at them and win keys which will unlock the treasure chamber. The more keys they win, the more time they'll get to grab the gold. The two teams who collect the most treasure over the series will go head to head in the grand final. But only one can emerge triumphant to win the trophy and to be crowned ultimate conquerors of the fort. Who has the skill, the nerve, the downright determination to succeed? Will it be one of the teams on today's Fort Boyard Ultimate Challenge? Welcome to Fort Boyard Ultimate Challenge. Two brave teams have stormed the fort, eager to take on any challenges that get between them and the treasure. Now, for every challenge they successfully complete, they'll get a key. Five is the magic number, because if they get five keys, they'll get the maximum amount of time in the treasure chamber. And it's all about the keys, because keys equal time, and time equals treasure. The team that gets the most treasure shall walk home with a glorious Fort Boyard trophy. So without further ado, shall we meet both our teams eager to do battle? Let's do it. No, we really, really want to win this. But we have our strength and we have great ability to do any challenge you want. I think we've got an all-round good team. You know, we definitely have what it takes. And I'm always up for a challenge, so I'll give anything a go. We don't know what you've been told. Jaggy was a brave and bold. I think we've got what it takes to go in the final. We can definitely win this. We've all got a different aspects of what we're good at, and then when that comes together, we just, we're just we great. Green Jaguars are going to win it. There's no doubt about it. High energy. Do you know what, Sophie? Welcome, Jaggers, by the way. I was already going to say, who is this man beast you've got at the end We here? don't know. We, you know? we think he's faking his age, but we're going to use him for the strength <laughs> challenges. Is, is Elias your secret weapon? Yeah. OK, I like this. I like this. Oh, oh tough team talk there. Now, Jake, you're team captain, aren't yeah. you, for the Falcons? Yeah. What makes you a good team captain? Uh, I'm, like, very talkative. I'm very loud. And I like to voice my opinion, so... OK, yeah. good. So we'll be hearing lots from you, yeah. then. Good yeah. stuff. And you've got anything you want to say to the Jaguars? Uh, just watch your back. back. You're going down. <laughs> watch your backs. You're going down. Any replies to that? Ready? Watch your backs when we attack. Watch, watch your, your backs, backs when we attack. attack. Nice. They sound like they're pretty vocal, don't they? Slightly well. harmonious. <laughs> I like it a lot. Well, <laughs> time for the first challenge. <laughs> OK, teams. First duel and first opportunity to win this key. Are we ready? Yes! yes. Are they ready? I like this a lot. <laughs> OK, this is what you have to do. Charlie and Daisy are holding on for dear life on these ropes. What the opposition team have to do is fill the counterweights with enough corn to lift them off the ground. Whichever of the two is propelled into the air first shall lose the key for their team. OK? Yeah. yeah. Let's OK. Go, team. Your challenge starts now. Let's go, Go. Holding on for dear life already. Oh, come on! Dropping a lot of corn here. Especially when it's a duel. They want it bad. That yeah. first key. Both teams really want it. Yeah. Awful lot of corn on the floor this side. Both teams are being pretty vocal, which they promised us when we met them. The trick here is not to waste too much corn. There's only a limited amount. The sun dropping on the floor. Now, is she struggling? Is Daisy struggling here? Can we see the tension in the uh, either Charlie? They're both looking pretty relaxed. Daisy's face is. I'm just looking for any foot movement. Just looking for any foot movement. Who's slightly on their tippy toes? Oh, oh, is there a movement here? Uh oh, uh oh. From the Jaguars. I can see Charlie. Oh, <laughs> 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 Stay on, stay on. We've got one more back here, one more back here. 
Charlie, are you just having a little dance there, or is it getting tough? It's also a test for the arms. It, they're going to have to start tensing up so they're holding on those ropes. So it's like, just a reminder, you have to get them all the way off the ground. Their hands have to be detached from the rope. How are those arms feeling, girls? I hurt. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> Charlie! Oh! oh. Daisy! <laughs> Look at the determination here. Is she coming off the floor? Tim Torres just on. She's off the floor. No, but this is the fact that she's off the floor. She just came off the floor. She's, she's still got to leave the ropes. She's still oh, got to leave the ropes. She's still got to leave the ropes. She's still got to leave the ropes. Oh, oh, Daisy slipping. Oh. The Jaguars are looking slightly ahead here. Daisy slipping. <laughs> Look at the determination of Daisy's face to stay on. <laughs> this is what Popoy is all about. Strength. Now, Charlie's got an interesting technique here. She's winding her feet you around the road. That won't last so much longer because those hands are going to give away. And so oh! Yes! <laughs> the Jaguars have the first key. Woo! Let's take a look at the replay. I don't think we got the tactic right on putting the, cor uh, the corner into Charlie's um, basket. We just did it once, and where's the other team that was trying to lift me? They did it about four times. I think using my legs gave me a massive advantage because just as I was, just as I wrapped my legs around and started holding on with my legs, Daisy flew up straight up in the air. Okay, okay, you two, you're finally down. Charlie, amazing technique. The legs kind of came into it there. What was going on? Well, I couldn't use, I didn't have much strength in my arms and it was getting really heavy, so I thought my legs would be a bit of an easier option. And Daisy, explain that strange <laughs> reaction to me. Nice. It yeah. was like... What was going on? There was some serious tension there. Just determination, just pure determination. <laughs> well, I was just trying to hang on for the team. How are your arms? My forearms are really hurting. Either way, you've popped some mind today, man. Well done. <laughs> OK, let's take a look at the scores so far. The Jaguars have one key and the Falcons have no keys. Chance to get a key now. Are you ready to fly solo? Yeah. Come on, follow me. Off we go. Woo, come on. Let's go, Falcons. Let's go. Let's go, Falcons. Let's go. Oh, guys, you didn't get the first key. Doesn't matter though, because this is your chance now. Yes. Who are you putting forward for this challenge, Jake? This challenge. You're doing it yes. for the team. Okay, right. Well, in this room, there are 20 jars. The key is in one of them, so all you've got to do is find it. Sounds right. pretty simple, OK? Yeah. But as you know, nothing is ever that simple here on the fort because those jars don't only contain a key, but they also contain some other surprises. They might be nice, they might be nasty. Who knows? Is there anything you're worried about with this challenge? Uh, probably mice. Yeah. Mice. mice. I'm not sure there's any mice in there, but <laughs> who knows? You shall take your place by the door and you need to find that key before the time runs out. Go. Are you ready? Your challenge starts now. In you go, in you go. Come on, Jake. Come Good on, luck, Jake. Jake, just put your hands in. Just straight go for in, it, just in. go for it. Don't look, don't look at them. Oh, we're going you to need mice to one. You need to have a good run of ground. Go right in. Oh. I Jake, seem to see some mice in there. Right to the <laughs> Jake. Straight in, straight in. What can you see in there, Jake? Oh, we stop. Jake, make sure you go right to the bottom. Don't, don't. Green stuff. Them, it... Now, there really isn't that much time for this game, so you are going to have to be quick, Jake. How much time have I got? You need, Jake, to, he go. needs to put his hand right in yeah. there. Jake, right right to the bottom. I'm going right to the bottom. What? You need to try the mice one as well if Jake, you can. Just go for it. Just do it. Oh. It's nothing, it's nothing, just go for it. For the team, Jake, for the team! Go come on. on! We really need this key. Jake, come on, oh, we need this. this! You're about halfway, okay? I can't see any, there's nothing in there. He oh. needs to have a really yeah, good, good rummage around, around, around because he might have touched that key. You need to try and not realise. Come on, Jake, quicker, come on! I know you don't like yeah, them, yeah, Jake, yeah. but you need to get your hand in with those mice. All the way. Gonna have to get out soon. Yeah. Not long Jake, left. Get them. Go in the mice. Come on, go in the mice. Last few. You're gonna have to get out. I got it. Oh, oh, I got it. Oh, 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 yes. Okay. <laughs> you got the key. I know. I'm going to be with the mice. I tell you oh. what. You definitely.
actually. No. You weren't going anywhere no, near those mice. Not anywhere near the mice. <laughs> I don't like mice, so I tried to avoid those ones. So I put my hands in. I just had to rummage through for the key. He definitely thought that the mice were actually just there to scare him. So we, we thought he was, he was quite clever, really, to think about that, because obviously, if, I, if, if it was me, I would have just chucked my hand in any of them. When the captain does well, I think the team does well. So I think we've, uh, uh, it was, there was a bit more pressure on me to try and get the key. Well, after that very brave challenge, let's have a look at the scoreboard. It's one key to the Jaguars and one key to the Falcons. <laughs> I was going to say, you might need to compose yourself, but yeah. I think you're pretty composed. Should we join Andy, who's with the Jaguars, for their next challenge? OK, Jaguars, just found out that yeah. the Falcons have won a key. So it's one all right now. Yeah. This next challenge is going to need someone with agility, with strength and a good brain. I can't nominate myself. <laughs> so, Captain, Sophie, who's doing this? We've decided to give this one to our secret weapon. OK. Elias. That's right, that's right. All right, this is you. Yes. Muscles from Brussels. <laughs> well, this is what you have to do. Inside is a pyramid, and attach to the pyramid are some bags. You just slide the bags up a pole until you've taken all the bags off. Then there's also the key, which will be there as well. You just slide that up the pole and try and make your way out before the time is up. Okay. Are you pumped? I'm pumped. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, make your way in. <laughs> I love this team. I love this team. Your time starts now. Here we go, mate. Give him some encouragement, team. Come on! He knows what's going on. Come on! You can do it! Come on, Come on, it. Come on, Come on it. Faster, faster! Come on, take the You can do it! Um, me. His height and strength Come are really me. beneficial here, aren't they? <laughs> He's making this look a bit too easy. We don't know, he just sort of showed up on the we boat. Don't, so we don't. Don't. <laughs> Isn't that becoming a legend? I don't think I've ever seen anything like this before. Done in such quick time and made it look so effortless. <laughs> The legend, mate! Look how much time he had left! <laughs> well, I, 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 I dare not ask, but how did you find that? It's all right. <laughs> it's good, it's good. Do you know what? I'm, I don't think since I've been doing the show I've ever seen someone do that so effortlessly. <laughs> Your height and strength completely helped you out there. They did, actually, yeah. I thought I was going to slip, but... No, I somehow stayed on. Not boasting, are you? Not boasting. No, not <laughs> Let's just take a look at that replay. Uh, when, before I went in, I, I, didn't, I didn't have a clue what to expect. My team told me, do what I do best, just lift them up, get them off, and that's what i done. Yeah, I just got into the rhythm, it was kind of bag after bag, same movement when I got to the top, and then the key was just at the bottom, just got it out, went out, got the key. Nice one! <laughs> Let's take a look at the scoreboard. OK, that's two keys to the Jaguars and one key to the Falcons! <laughs> Plenty more keys still to be won and plenty more challenges still to come on Fort Boyard Ultimate Challenge. Join us after the break. Well done, guys. <laughs> Welcome back to Fort Boyard Ultimate Challenge. The Jaguars are doing battle against the Falcons to win as many keys as they can from the fort. So far, the Jaguars have two keys and the Falcons have one. There's still plenty more keys up for grabs, though, and this next challenge is for both of our teams. For this duel, we have our two team captains going head to head. It's Sophie versus Jake. Now, this is a room with a difference because the longer you stay in there, the smaller it gets. There's a grid above your head that has four tools. It's the white tools for the Falcons, the black tools for the Jaguars. Only two of those tools will open your team's boxes. The boxes contain the code, so you need to shout that code out to your teammates who can open the box to grab the key. Now, whilst you're doing this, the ceiling is going to be getting lower, <laughs> and there's also a nice little surprise in there for you. You know we like surprises here, that's right? What we are, that's what we do. <laughs> Jake, what's going through uh, your mind right now? I'm a bit nervous to see what the surprise is, but I'm excited at the same time. OK. So, yeah. Good stuff. And what about you, Sophie? How are you at coping with small spaces? I'm fine with small spaces, but I'll still have to just ignore it and just get on with getting the key. 
Are you ready? Yeah, go. Come on, Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. The challenge starts now! So Sophie for the Jaguars is going for the black tools and Falcon Jake is looking for the white ones. They are so focused on finding those tools, it doesn't look like they've noticed the huge snake on the floor. Oh, Sophie's noticed it now. That snake is huge. Go, Sophie. Sophie's doing her best to get the tool off the overhead grid without going near the snake. And Jake, well, it looks a bit lost. Go, Sophie. Don't forget, two of those tools are bogus and they won't work at all. There we go, Sophie's got one first. Let's see if it's the right one. Yes, Sophie's found one of the correct black tools. She's halfway there. It's getting lower and lower. I don't know if I like this challenge. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not into sort of claustrophobic environments with snakes. So you're mixing two fears together. I'm not into that at all. Jane looks like he's struggling there. It's the second tool Sophie's been able to get. Is that the right one? 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 It's all right. Yes, 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 yes. All right, let's take a listen. Take a listen. Take time, Sophie. Get out. Three, seven, eight, four. Jake's not giving up, though. Three, seven, eight, four. Could this be another key for the Jackers? Three, seven, eight, four. Is it the right way? Is that the right way? Three, seven, eight, four. Anything could happen. Come on, Jake. Yes. Jake, out you come. Yeah. It's another victory yes. for the Jaguars. First of all, I went straight to the cage and I tried to visualise the sizes of the um, bolts so then I could pretty much know what the size of the tool was so I knew what I had to look for. We kept getting jammed, so I kept turning it, but I kept turning it too far or too little, so I just moved on to the next one. And there was a snake in the corner. The longer I was in the room, I started to worry about the snake less because I realised that it just pretty much stayed put and didn't really worry about what we were doing, so I didn't worry about what it was doing. Let's have a look at the scoreboard. The Jaguars have extended their lead with three keys and the Falcons have won. because there's plenty more keys to be won here on the fort and it's time now for your solo challenge. You ready to follow me? Yes. Yep. Come on, let's keep that team moving. Oh, 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 yes. Let's go. Let's go, Falcons. Let's go. <laughs> Jake, this is your chance to bring your team back into the game. 3-1 yeah, right now, yeah? So this is your chance to yeah. get another key. Now, I need three of you for this challenge. So who are you putting forward? Ella. Daisy and Josh. You're going to have a bit of a break. Yeah. <laughs> OK, now, in this room, there are nine poles that run from the floor to the ceiling. The ceiling is a grid numbered one to nine. Now, you've got to climb the poles, press the buttons on the ceiling, which will light up. If they're correct, they'll go green, and you need to find three green lights in a row. It's a bit like noughts and crosses. Good luck. Really want you to get this key. We will, we will. Let's go. You do have to make sure you stay up that pole and press the green lights so they're all on at the same time. If you don't do that, you won't get the key. And of course, you are up against the clock. Okay. Not much time. Your challenge starts now. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Right, I'll go the, I'll go the Come on. Now that went red, so four is no good for you. Try another. This one's green, this one's green. That's green. Five went green, so you've got one of the numbers. No, 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 that's another red one. Six is wrong. Push, push. No. That's red two. Bad luck. That's a green one, so you've got nine and five. You just need one more. Needs to be in a straight line. That's it, that's a green one. So you found the numbers one, five, and nine. We need to hold those buttons all down at the same time. You 
need to hold them all down at the same time. Okay, that's one, five. Hold it. Can we do this? Five seconds. Five seconds. Here we go. Come on, guys. You can do this. Hold me up again. Daisy's arms are really burning here. Unsurprisingly, because she, of course, yeah. uh, did the first challenge. So, yeah. come on, guys, you've got the Stand numbers. You just need to hold them down for a couple of seconds. Here we go. Can we do this? It's so close. It's going to be so close. Come on. Daisy's just fallen. This is fantastic teamwork here. Josh is working so hard. Josh, what do you want to really support the team? You're going to have to come out. You're going to have to come out, guys. Oh. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, team, team, that was so unlucky. unlucky. Just talk me through what was going on there. My arms are absolutely killing. That was the hardest challenge I've actually seen on 4 Beyond. It may not look like really hard, but it was the hardest challenge I've ever done. Uh, Daisy and Ella, they weren't able to, you know, properly get up the poles and they weren't able to, you know, uh, keep themselves up there. So we didn't really all go to plan, you know, I had to help them. It was really, really hard to get the technique, but Josh got it straight away and he was managing to get up all the poles and we found the line thanks to him. They gave it a good go, you know, they both did their best. Good effort. Give yourselves a round of applause. Let's have a look at the scoreboard. It's three keys to the Jaguars and one key to the Falcons. Oh, rest those arms. Give yourself a bit of a break. Here's Andy with the Jaguars. Right, team. Elias is getting ready for the next duel. But in the meantime, don't want to put any pressure on you, but the Falcons didn't get their key. And you guys are on a pretty good momentum right now. So, Jordan, you're doing this one, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Right, this is what you have to do. Inside are five giant cylinders. You need to slide across the cylinders and grab the key in the allotted time. But if you fall off the cylinders, you have to go back to the beginning. All right? Yeah. How are you feeling about this? I'm feeling pretty pumped, psyched, you know? Yeah? Yeah. Pumped, psyched, in a very chilled way. <laughs> I am, I'm very chilled, but I'm actually really excited to be doing a challenge. Okay, good. Have you got a good balance? I have, I'm quite balanced. All right. I would say. And you could, you, earlier you were like, I can shift my weight, can't I? Yeah, can... I'm really good at that. <laughs> <laughs> and you've got to do it with your hands in your pockets. And, oh, hips don't lie, baby. All right, get in there, because your time starts now. Okay, on, here it goes. Yeah, take it slow. Take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Take Take your time. Take it 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 You still got plenty of time, mate. Flash, 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 plenty flash. of time. You go so come on, you can do it. Oh, so close. You've got a bit more time. Come on, mate. Come on. Come on, really slow. Keep it really, really slow. Keep your weight balanced. Keep yourself focused. Keep your legs together. Really slow. Slow Don't down. rush it. Slow Don't down. rush it. The thing is, you want to be quick on this one, but it's very hard to be patient because the key is just in sight. It's that final one. It's that final. Well done, lad. Well done, lad. No! No! One more time, Jordan. Come on! One more time. We've almost done it. <laughs> oh. Slower. Here he is, here he is. Oh, it's almost there. Uh... Now, come on, let's do it! Come on! Time's running out, Jordan! You're gonna have to come out! Oh! Mate! Don't be disheartened, it was really close. Let's take a look at that replay. It was a really long cylinder that I was having real, uh, real trouble with, and the one in front of it was like a big step up, and because I was on my stomach, it took me a while. I was about maybe a few shimmies away and then just as I was about went to grab it I fell off and it was really it was really devastating 
All right, Jaguars. Unlucky. Don't be deterred. Keep that momentum going. Let's look at the scoreboard once again. So, the Jaguars have three keys still, and the Falcons still have one. All right, Jaguars, time for our next duel. We can bring this back, can't we? Yeah! Come on, let's go. OK, teams, third duel of the show. And Josh and Elias are going to be doing this. And this is what they have to do. They're submerged below the fort's floor, and in there are two boxes. Inside the boxes are two balloons. They have to inflate the balloons big enough to be popped by the pin. Once the balloon is popped, a code will be revealed on the ball. Once they find the code, they need to come up, shout it out to you guys, who are going to be hopefully waiting at that key box. Do you think they can do it? Yes. Yeah? Well, Joss needs to bring one back for you guys because you're two keys down. Yep. And uh, Elias could stretch this lead even further. We can do it, though, guys, can't we? Come on. All right. We can do it. All right, all right. Fighting <laughs> talk already. I like this. Yeah. OK, Josh, Elias. Yeah. yeah. Your challenge. Starts now. Come on! Yeah! Yeah! That's it! Come on, we're done! Come on. We've got Josh and White, Elias in black. Here they go. Who has got the lungs on this one? It looks Elias has done it already! Wow. All right, guys, get ready. Get ready for the coach. He just seems to make every challenge look. Two, five, seven, three. He just seems to make every challenge look so easy. Come on, Josh! Lots of encouragement. Keep trying to... You got it? OK, we've got the code up here, Elias. Let's... Uh, Josh, you need to inflate that balloon. Jaguars have taken the key! You know, when we first got in the water, I really didn't expect it to be as cold as it was. You know, as soon as you got in there, it took, it took your breath away. I took one big breath, got down, blew as much as I could in, and I, I saw I got quite a lot through, and I thought I'd come up for a second breath. Second one, got in, popped it. I couldn't see how far ahead he was. I was just concentrating on what I was doing. You know, so when, when he finished, he was out. I didn't even know he was out. Elias, mate, well done! <laughs> Unbelievable. You seem to have just done it in one blow. Who are you? <laughs> Went for it, thought I'd just get it all out in one. Try my best and then, yeah. <laughs> right, let's take a look at the score so far. The Jaguars have four keys and the Falcons have one. Well done, Jaguars! <laughs> you know what? Plenty more keys still to be won. You don't want to miss a thing. Join us after the break. ultimate challenge. Right now it's a tense battle between the Jaguars and the Falcons. The Jaguars are storming the lead with four keys and the Falcons have won but anything can happen here on the fort and right now it's a challenge for the Falcons. Jake, you're being a fantastic team captain, but I can't stress how important this key is. No, no. Valuable time in the treasure chamber. Yeah. Who's going to be doing this challenge? Ella. Ella, come on over. <laughs> Welcome to the coldest room on the fort. It's the freezer. In here, there's a padlock key on a ring. You've got to slide that ring along the frozen pipes all through the obstacles to the box. Open the box to grab the key that you're looking for. Yeah. Happy with that? Yeah. All makes sense? Yeah. You look a bit nervous. <laughs> I am, um, yeah. It's going to be cold. What are you like with the cold? I'm actually all right, but not when I'm just in a top and some trousers. <laughs> think, think warm things. Okay. And we'll be out here cheering you on. And we really want this key. Yeah. Good luck. Thank you. You are up against the clock. Okay. You're going to go through this door. Yep. Your challenge starts now. Go on, Ella. Go on, Ella. Go on, Ella. Go on, Ella. Help her as much as you there can. There we go, that's it. Keep moving it. Wow, around. she's got the key. Yes, that's it. Wow. Easy. Quick, quick, quick. Head first. Good head advice first. there. Get in, head first. She has got to go in. Head first. There we go. Let's go. Come on, Come on. Come on. You really want Come this key. On. Come on, Ella. Come on. Negotiating the well, rope there. Why don't you do it? Keep going. Come on, Ella. Come on. Go, Ella. Keep moving through. Straight through. Making this look quite on. easy so far, don't you think? Yeah. <laughs> well done, Ella. Keep going. Well done, Ella. Come on, come on. 
She's through the first obstacle there. How are we doing for time? Do you want to update her on time? And we've got loads of time left. Keep going, keep going. Steady pace. Come on, getting feet first. Come on, jump in, come on. Getting feet first. She's just got to go for this. She's got to go for it. There we go, feet first. That's it. There you go, move in. Wow. Wow. I'm not sure I fancy an ice bath. <laughs> But she's in. Go. Fully submerged. Go down, keep going down, that's it. Put it along, put it along. She might need to go get that head under. Yeah. Hello, Hello. Guys, go in, all of you. Get all of you in if you can. That's oh, it. Go. You're yeah. nearly there, you're nearly there. Great work. Well, so So I'm doing that. Yes, no, no, no. Get up, she's done it. Get up, she has done it. Bring that. Come on. Come on, get that key and get out. Watch yourself. Oh, quick, quick, quick. Oh, Not long left. Get out, get out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ella, you got the key. Oh, How was that? Because <laughs> you made it look so easy. Oh, it really wasn't. <laughs> It was a really tough challenge because it was so cold and it was so hard to get your arm like all around the place and your hands are shaking because it's so cold and it was really hard to get it all around the little pipes. I was determined not to put my head under because I knew it was going to be so cold and I managed to just about reach the bottom and pull the key up around the top and unlock the cupboard which had the key in. You, you kind of jumped in there straight away, you, yeah. you didn't seem to be phased by it. No, just, well we need to win it for the team so this one really meant everything to us so... It yeah. certainly did. Let's have a look at the scoreboard. It's four keys to the Jaguars and two keys to the Falcons. Well done, team! Right, we're going to get you a towel. <laughs> you can warm up a bit and get your breath back. Here's Andy with the Jaguars. OK, Jaguars, your turn to secure yourself another key. Lovely Sophie, team leader, the Whippet. <laughs> You're up there on that giant hoop, right? What you need to do is make your way all the way around the hoop. And attached to the hoop are four cylinders. Inside the cylinders are little balls which contain numbers which will reveal the code which you need to give your teammates who are waiting at the bottom. But below you are some very hungry tigers looking at you eagerly, licking their lips. How do you feel about that? I'm very aware of the tigers right now, but I'm just going to have to ignore them and keep my mind on the wheel. OK, OK. She's so sweet. <laughs> I like her. OK, are you ready? Your challenge starts now. Come on, Sophie! Come on, Sophie. Oh, you can do it, that's it. Keep going. Sit so really, keep going. Come on, you can do it. That's it. Oh, even more. Here you go. And that's it. Make sure you don't chuck the ball out. Make sure you shout out loud and read it. Four, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Four, dot, dot. So that's four, dot, dot. Oh, oh, Tiger's seen it. Oh, Tiger's on the move. Tiger's are on the move. <laughs> now, what's going to be tricky about this bit is how she's going to come down the other side. Is she going to go forwards, backwards? I mean, it's up to you guys to tell her which way to go. Yeah, that's it. Well done, Sophie. Well, Sophie. What you got in there, Sophie? Nothing, it's blank. Nothing, keep going, keep going. Oh. Go slowly, go slowly. Go slowly. That hoop looks very slippery. Make sure you keep a firm grip. Every time you drop a ball, the tigers awaken. <laughs> they start moving. Come on, Sophie, you can do it! Keep going. OK. Keep going, Sophie. Keep going. Well done, mate. Well done. Four, seven, dot, dot. Seven's the next number. Hey. Come on, keep going, that's it. Keep going now. So the final two numbers are on the hardest of the cylinders. Well, hold on tight, Sophie. Try and monkey bar it. This is a real tough one. Time is ticking. She might need 
to try and secure her feet as well while she's, you know, trying to monkey bar it. Hold on tight, Sophie. Go on, monkey bar you can do it. Yes, well done, Sophie. Good grip. You've got to keep going, Sophie. There you, there you go, there you go. Secured. Well done, Sophie. Keep going. Oh, look at this. Time is running out, Sophie. Be careful. Hurry up, Sophie. You can do it. Time is up, time is up, time is up. Unlucky. Oh! You're right there, mate. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay, okay. Unlucky. Oh. Unlucky. Let's just take a look at the replay. My plan going in was just to not look down because the whole hoop was hanging over where the tigers were. So it was really, really nerve wracking there. Every time I dropped the ping pong ball, once I'd read out the number, they would look at it and go crazy. So I was just trying to ignore them, really. Um, I realised that I didn't know which, which way I was supposed to go to get the last cylinder. So then I decided to go in between the wheel and the ladder. So I got a bit stuck. Well done, Sophie. Well done. Dude, what happened? Talk to me. My arm got stuck, so I wasted too much time trying to get it through. Oh, mate, you were so close. It was the final. That is the trick one, because no-one quite knows which way to go, and uh, unfortunately, you went the wrong way. But <laughs> let's take a look at the scores so far. So the Jaguars have four keys, and the Falcons have two. Well done, guys. Well done. Ooh. All right. Thanks, Sophie. One more opportunity to win a key. It's time to go to the final duel. Let's go, guys. Come on. Go, Jaguars. <laughs> Jaguars, Falcons, here we are then. This is your last chance to get a key. Final fight before you enter the treasure chamber. In front of you, you'll see two blocks. The white block is for the Falcons, the black block is for the Jaguars. One at a time, you've got to step forward, resting a nut on the block, and the first person that makes their block topple will lose the challenge for the team. Does that all make sense? Yeah. 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 So, team captain, Jake, you're going to step forward first. Remember, you cannot touch the table. If anything falls off, the nut, the block, you will lose the challenge for your team. To place the block, is you've got to be really careful because it just wobbles and wobbles and it can go at any time. Ella? It was so tense in the room, you could tell, because everybody wanted that key. Who's stepping forward next from the deck is Charlie? Daisy. Once you've committed, oh. you've got to stick with it. Here we go then. Third block, Elias. Once you commit, you got it. came to me and I mean, a bit heavy-handed myself. I managed to... I, I didn't even get it on, really. I kind of dropped it before I could get it on, which was a shame, and uh, we ended up losing that challenge. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Guys, to the Falcons! All yours, Falcons, all yours. Yes, you needed well that. Done. All right, let's take a look at the scores. It is now four keys to the Jaguars and three keys to the Falcons! Guess where we're heading now? the gate and receive the full three minutes in the treasure chamber, each team must have five keys. For each key less than five, there's a ten-second time penalty. Each key over five earns a bonus of 150 gold coins. Once the gate is unlocked, the time begins and each team will be shown a map of the treasure chamber floor with four crests marked on it. They must memorise the four crest positions on the map and then place them on the corresponding squares on the chamber floor, all under the watchful eyes of the Forts Tigers. Each player then places a hand on the scanner, and if they're correct, the key to the treasure chest will be released, and the team can start collecting the gold. If they get it wrong, they must reposition their crests until they get it right. The team with the most coins wins. Here we are then, congratulations.
congratulations, Ooh. team. This is Roger Kramer. Yeah. <laughs> now, this is what it's all about. It's a straight race to grab as many gold coins as you can. Your total will be added to the overall leaderboard score. Now, you basically needed five keys to get the maximum amount of time in that treasure chamber. We'll start with you, Jaguars. That final key, that fifth key eluded you, didn't it? Yeah. 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 So many opportunities. But you have got a turn tech on time penalty. But also, anything had happened, this is a treasure chamber. Yeah. All right? So I'll just put this in there for you. Anything indeed can happen, and you guys have proved that. You got three keys. You brought yourselves back in the game. Well done, Woo! well done. Two keys short, though. That means you're going to have a 20 second time penalty. So I'm going to put these in just here. Jaguars, when the gate starts to open, your map will be revealed. Falcons, your map will be revealed once your time penalty is up. Is everyone happy? Yeah. Yes. Is everyone ready to do this? Yes. yes. Andy. Never heard so much noise. <laughs> OK. Love this bit. Your challenge starts now. There's the Jaguars map. Go, go, go. Oh, you're cool, calm, collected, Andy. Well, Look at you. I've you're got nothing like, to yeah. do here. We've just got to observe we can't get and watch it way. happen. I'm chomping at the bit, aren't they? <laughs> oh, there's the Falcons map. Have you got it right? You, you can, can go, go. You can go. Once it's, it's open, you can go. Doing? Look at that. Look at Wasted all time. that time. Ten oh, seconds. This lot, honestly. The gate starts to open. They just stand and watch. Okay. Wow. Let's just hope they have it in the right order. Pull the lever. Yes. Go, oh, Jaguars. They got their key. Grab the key and open the box. No, no. Who's wrong? Who's wrong? And Falcons have oh, made a mistake. Falcons are faulted. They're flapped. Wasting valuable time here. Yes! Where the, have they gone wrong? The gold is released, Jaguars! Every second Steady is precious, now. Jaguars. Be careful, on those Be careful steps. this is quite a wet surface. Jordan, watch your step. Some big leaps there. And finally, right, Falcons have done it. it. The Tigers are watching every move you make in there, guys. They're not happy about you taking their gold. They're Falcons struggling still. there with that box. Oh, no, they've, they've done it. They've done it. They've now done both it. teams can start collecting coins. Throw it in there. The more gold you get. Bit of catching up to do, Falcons. Come on, but take it easy on those steps, please. But also, just, just have a oh, thought for the leaderboard, if you think about it. The more good. gold you collect, the higher the potential on, to be top of the leaderboard. You can do this. Remember, your scores will be added to the overall tournament leaderboard. Grab and go. Don't be slow. <laughs> it's a bit cheesy, isn't it? I like it. That's exactly what it says on the tin. <laughs> that does do exactly what it says on the tin. Oh. Is there much gold left? Good work there, Sophie. And the Jaguars, is there much gold left? They have done so well. There's the ball. The gate is closing. Make your way out! That gate is go, go, go. Make your way out! The gate is closing! Come on! Come on! Come on! The gate is closing! Oh! I don't actually think you've ever been that close. Let's have a look at the action replay. Trench chamber was the best, the best, it was the highlight of the day. After we saw the map, we were actually waiting for the gate to go up so there's enough space for us to get through. Once we got through, we were just off. We were like bullets, gone straight away. We managed to get one of the crests in the wrong place, but we got that change back like really quickly and um, we managed to get the chest open and grabbed as many coins as we could. By the time we got to the end, there weren't much more coins to get, so um, it went well. OK, the moment we've all been waiting for. Time to find out just how much gold both these teams have taken. Jaguars, we'll start with you. Load it up. Well, <laughs> oh, is it that much gold you can't even stand? <laughs> steady, Jordan. Jordan, you can put yourself in there and add your weight to your total. All right, just neaten this up. Let's take a look at your total. One hundred and thirty. That is monumental. All right, we put it back in the box. That was unbelievable. That was a great score. 
Falcons, can you beat it? Time okay. to find out. Now, you did get your map wrong mm. the first time, but you caught up pretty well. Make take, sure you though. get all those coins out. Every single one counts. Good take. Can you beat the Jaguars? So, 1,130 to beat. Well, let's see how that affects the overall tournament leaderboard. The Falcons go into third place, but the Jaguars' great score of 1,130 puts them into first place ahead of the Scorpions. Great effort. You know, yet another great episode of Fort Boyard Ultimate Challenge. Cannot wait for the next one. No, indeed. Make sure you do join us next time for more Fort Boyard Ultimate Challenge. See you later. Bye-bye.